Ladies, I'm just so excited, I mean. It's been five months since all four of us were together last. Well, ladies, let that wait officially be over because I'm back. Oh my gosh, Sarah, it's been forever. Just, <gasps> Sarah, whose child is that? Well, we have a lot to catch up on, don't we? Are you all able to meet me for dinner tonight? Hey, Brianna, you have some visitors. I let them in through the door. Oh my God, you have got to be kidding. Hi, mom. Look, Brianna, I know today isn't the day we agreed on, but I can explain. I have a huge meeting with some investors looking to invest $10 million into the company. I mean, this can be life-changing for me. And I can't bring my daughter to the meeting. Well, Chad, I had a meeting to today. A meeting with the couch and ice cream and Johnny Desperado on my new flat screen TV. Why couldn't you have just left April with Jocelyn for your meeting? Oh, come on now, you know Jocelyn hates children. There's a reason why our own son won't come and visit us. Look, Brianna, next week I swear I'll pick up April a day early, but I have to get going. Chad, get the hell out of my office before I throw these scissors at your face. And it's not funny, Susan. Well, Sarah, this meal is just great and all, but don't you have something to explain, hun? Well, I... I guess I do. Ladies, I found out I was three months pregnant about a week before I left for Mexico. You see, Raul is not Romeo's biological father, but his real father? Well, that's someone I won't speak of. I met Raul in Mexico and I told him about the sticky situation I was in. He vowed to get married and we eloped. About a month later is when I finally had Romeo and our happy little family began. Okay, since no one else is saying it, Sarah, is this a joke? No, it is not Jocelyn. Why does everything I say to you have to be taken as a joke? Okay, ladies, we're not gonna fight. We're going to take it all in and take a deep breath. You know, Jocelyn, my situation might be unusual to you, but your situation is just unusual to all of us. I mean, you stay with the man who cheated on you three times and even had a secret love child that you didn't find out until years later? How dare you bring up my husband's infidelity? You know we struggle with that. Sarah, you're a bitch. I'm out of here. You know, Jocelyn, you're the most stone, cold-hearted little whore I've ever met in my life. Get the hell out of my house. Jocelyn Hernandez, it's been months. What are you doing on this side of town? Cole, your wife has officially lost her marbles and I need your help. Oh, trust me, Jocelyn. I've already heard of it, and it's not anyone else's problems, but hers. I think we both should stay out of it. Fine. Just leave it all on Jocelyn Hernandez to save the fucking day once again. I'm out of here, Cole. Raul, dear, where are you? We need you to cut the cake. I already have the knife, dear. Just bring the cake. Oh. Anything you say, my dear. <laughs>